Hello everybody, and welcome back to Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door. We are gonna go on the train to Glitzville today. So we're gonna do that adventure. So it should be pretty good. Yep, I just apparently am somehow down a health point. I don't know how I'm down a health point. You ran into a rock and lost a health point when you stuck your toe. Oh. I'm gonna go heal then. All right. On a train-related note, uh, today, out, just outside of work, I heard somebody whistling Sparkle's theme. Nice. What? Like IRL? What the hell? Yeah. They were actually whist. Like, how, did you did you know Not it was Sparkle? Not really, really theme? well, but. But it was Sparkle. Yeah, pretty, pretty, pretty recognizably like, Sparkle's theme. Like it was. Yeah. Like it was that. No, because you can't hold the tune to save your life. Look, I haven't whistled. That's more like it. There you go, Dan. That's Daniel. Yep. I love Monodrama. It's such a good, like, song. I'm so glad they actually use... I, I like that they're actually using the character trailer themes in-game. It's so nice, because usually you see that and they just don't. Yeah. Like, I like that they used the Sparkle's theme for that. They used Acheron's theme for when she just blasted Aventurine to hell. Like, it's nice when they do that. Mm. Here's my ticket, good sir. You becoming bored? Yes. Watch your step. No. I have a bomb with me. We will not watch our step. Exactly. All aboard. Aren't you supposed to say all aboard before the train doors close? Uh -oh. Yes. Apparently yeah. not in this universe, though. Ah, God. It's like the Genshin loading screen. Three days of excess. Oh, God, we're here for three days. We're making potato salad for three days. Mario's cabin. Three days. The Excess Express. Rather posh. I must say yes. Rather posh indeed. Three days posh. It's us to pass in an eye blink. Hey, oh, boy. No? Well, I'll be bomb. What's that on the floor? When did it get here? It's a note. Don't go to Posh Let's get off the train now. Our sticky, yummy doom awaits it. Our what, exactly? Brother Odd Thread 8, you don't think that Beldum's crone's responsible, do you? Our guys, it may be the scoundrels surely on this very train. Let's rouse the swine, but they have the chance to cause mischief. You got a shine sprite. Wait, are you even telling me that if we had just progressed, we would have gotten that 1 HP back anyway? It's fine. Yeah, we're saving successfully. Yep. Oh, hello. She looks suspicious. We should whack Welcome, her. welcome, welcome. This is the dining car. We're eating stuff. Some people take the strain just so they can eat our yummy, fabulous food. I don't believe On this trip, we have a super famous actor on board. Zip Toad. Oh my gosh. I'm Super totally swinging. I so hope he comes here soon. I want an autograph. Why is your chef a fish? Hello, I'm Sif Shimi, the culinary expert. Glad to make your complaints. Uh, I mean acquaintance. Chef so Chief. sorry. Cheap cheap is my first language, you know. Today's lunch is so amazing, it'll make your tongue cry out in shame. Lucy tastes that some of my passion does not wither alone in the pot of loneliness. I'm not sure I'm convinced. What is this? Oh, uh, it's got a super shroom, maple syrup, tasty tonic, booze sheet, a mystery, and thunder rage. What do I have on? Yeah, let me talk to the toad. Let me see what I have in here. I have a couple booze sheets. Yeah, I don't need those. And I'm gonna store some lightnings. Hmm. Well, don't you have too many items? Yeah, so I need to figure out what to store. Well, 
we have thunder bolts, but those are weaker than the thunder rages, right? Because thunder rages yeah. is every enemy. Yeah, because that's an enemy. Honestly, maybe we should get rid of some of the gradual stuff and just get immediate bonuses. Yeah, I think so that's like, what I'm gonna do. Like another maple syrup, too. Let's buy. This is all enemies. Oh, yes, I would like to A nice ice there. storm. Nice, we got that for free because we spent coins. Well, let's keep spending. Let me sell him actually some of my items. Not a bad idea. Oh, I have to store the. Oh, I have to. Let me withdraw some of the like the things. I'm gonna withdraw that. I'm gonna store here. I'm gonna do a bunch of uh, management. I really do wish that they had fixed the inventory. System. Yeah, the inventory system's a fucking mess. Yeah. Like to withdraw stuff, please. What are the boo sheets even? It prevents you from being damaged. Uh. I want to open the mystery. Screw it. I agree. I want to see what's in the mystery box. Watch it be absolutely. Oh, we had to use it in battle. Yeah, we had to use it in battle. Well, we got room for one more inventory slot. I think I'll grab oh, another thunder. super shroom. Yeah, actually, honestly, that's a good idea. I need more damage. <laughs> yes, here we go. We got some mind management done. If it wasn't apparent, or I am all damaged all the time. It was, in fact, apparent. I'm on my way back home. I've stayed so long, straight so long, I've forgotten what it looks like. Thank you. That's probably not a good thing. Oh, Me, I have a very important deal to attend to once we arrive in Parsley Heights. Traveling on business, so everything goes in the expense account. Yes! Oh, yeah. No, chat, there's nothing like being able to expense shit you're paying for. It's great. Right, but also, uh, you accidentally throw your company into the red. <laughs> you can't spend that much. Are you the champion of Glitzpit? Are you not? Yes, the great Gonzalez. I'm from Washington Heights? Well, it's certainly a fitting place for a celebrity like you. I'm going to Washington Heights my birthday present for little Bub here. My, my, my. Yeah, I'm Bub, and we're going to get a birthday present for me, and it'll be cool. Are you jealous? No. Are you sure you have the money to do that after going to this place? Those people are loaded. Apparently. Welcome to the Excess Express. I'm the conductor of the train. I trust you must be Mr. Mario from Captain 5. Make yourself at home, sir. Did you know behind you? Here's a baggage card. Sorry, but I can't let passengers in. What's that? Some sort of a sticky, yummy threat? I see. Good gracious me. Thank you for letting me know. Please be careful out there and return to your cabin. Well, sure so we found Pom Pom, chat. Really? I mean, he's the conductor. Right. Actually, I had a question. Aren't conductors usually the people at the front of the train, not 
They go back and forth every so often. Oh wow, there's a lot of people the, the here conductor, now. The conductor goes up and down the train. Something's oh. Going on here. Yeah, what's going on here? I was gonna have a nice lunch in my expense account. Rats. This is truly unfortunate. Rats. Almost tragic, really. I see what you did there. I'm dying for a taco guy. Can you swap with some glare up real quick? What, they took the whole pot? Really? The whole deal? This isn't even my contract. Oh no, zip toad is here and everything. No, my life is totally ruined. No, my heart cries out in the salty pain of misery. That was my masterpiece. I mean, my masterpiece. Now it's gone, I'm left with tears of horror in my eyes. What's going with you, bud? That was my master chief. Hmm, yes, I can see without that slightest hesitation, this smells like a case to me. What should we call ah. it? That is the question before us. Yes, what to call it? Yes, the cause of the pot of supper, supper stew that vanished suddenly and mysteriously. Indeed, that will do nicely. Mm. I'm gonna send, buddy. Dear train passengers, it's a full fledged mystery, one that impacts you all. What? A mystery? A mystery, you just said. And, uh, exactly, what kind of dish is that? I'm known as Pennington. You're lucky not guess it, but I'm a detective. Gee, I wouldn't have realized. No risk of modesty may say I have a certain nose for these things. I couldn't tell. This little country, my dear fellow passengers, poses no challenge to me. And it was you, Dio. Such a clue this case and all most of the water ones as it happens. So the perpetrator took the whole pot, stupid all, and so my esteemed friends. And include the one responsible. Is you, you gluttonous woman. Wait, what? Wait. Me? You tell totally cuckoo? I have no idea what you're talking about. Uh, pardon me, sorry. Please accept my apologies, my dear woman. You don't need to practice my accusations because you understand. Yes, sorry. What the fuck? <laughs> I know. Very good. Now let's get serious, shall we? I said believe it would be a case worthy of my intellect. Yes. Ah, uh, yes. Let me get uh, this straight. Zero brain. So, what we know so far is that we don't know who the culprit is. And I guess that's about it, right? I see control squares. Forget you guys. I'm going back to my cabin. You there? In a bit of hurry, get back to your cabin, eh? You, sir, are highly suspicious. I've just broken this case. The true culprit, I believe, is Zipto, the actor. Zipto, the Zipto. No. No way, Mr. Detective Person. Just making stuff up. You, you Tweety geezer. What is going geezer. on? Geezer. Can't say I deserve such a verbal thrashing, but well then, who did it, huh? This detective is not very. This is the confounding step. This detective does not detect too good. The trace no. thing on the floor. There's spilled stew here. I don't think that stew is sticky. Depends on the stew. Yeah. Continuing. Four. Three. Wait. Um. Good luck. Oh, what do you want? Good. Say about that now. What are you just saying? Apart from the kitchen. I get food gets certainly blame me right away with no evidence. Not nice. What? Drops the stew on the floor outside. I wouldn't know anything about that. Nah, people spill stuff. Nothing in the drawer, so need to look you and find a thing. But did we check him? You're sitting under the magazines. The galley pot. How the heck did he manage to stuff an entire pot into that drawer? Talent? I'm sorry, you know, it was me. So, you were so enamored by the stew you wanted to steal it to devour more? I still the entire problem the chef was shopping in shallots? Answer. Yes, yes, that's right. I'm just so sorry, but it's a brief moment of weakness. It won't happen again. They sure freaking old. This has been, sir, very satisfying. This terrible crime never recur. Neomedi, sir. Yes, you with the unkempt facial hair. My keen soothing and sexy stuff, I use the correct person to call this ruffian. Without that note in your cabin. Yes, I know of it. There's a lone detective on this train, the conductor confided in me. Oh god, we're all We cannot good. speak here. Find me in cabin six so we discuss this in private. Let's turn the pot to the chef if you could. Well, 
Thank you for causing all the commotion. And Sue is scrum diddly umptious. Can't wait for dinner. Real talk, if your entire train meal plan is disrupted by a single pot of stew going missing, I don't think that says a lot or that says a lot about the cooking capacities of this giant ass train that you have. Is your pot? Right? Yeah. Start piece. All right. Oh, hey, there is a. But yeah, like that's enough that I would say Greg would be filled, and that would be it. <laughs> four people or five-ish people. I really don't think I'd be filled, but. Well, yes. Case in point, this is not enough for a train that costs this much to go to a posh place. Let me out. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Aha! I've been waiting. This is what I'm impressed with your work on this last case, I must admit. I don't think the one you have is sticky, yummy, malcontent. I do just in the lack of any incriminating clues in this cabin. In case I must say, I believe you have a certain knack for detective work. It's just that I should take you on as my new assistant. Titterate, my name is Pennington, and I'm a detective from Boshley Heights. I'm known in some circles as the Penguin with the Improbably Large Brain. I'm sure you've heard of me, so that's all I'll say on the subject. I should name, How wait, I demand you do not sell exactly? me. I shall deduce your identity. The five circles of the Olympics. Mustache, the nose. Hmm. Oh, Teasy, you are obviously the famed Luigi, <laughs> are you not? Correct. Now you introduce yourself. I know about the famous Luigi. Oh. About the set, our man has declared his intent to yummify the train. Sucky, tasty explosion. The family of the bombs, they are definitely suspect. Now, Luigi, we will reduce this case to rudimentary facts and deduce the truth. It's later in the day now. Apparently, it's only later in the day if you leave the room. Also, I'm blaming the conductor. The conductor did it. Hmm. Did you know the Advanced Thunder's classic series of Bob Omri? Sure, it's cheap and boring. Things run luxurious to your pep's car or house. Hey, Nobody's too small to for such things, Gold Bob. Something of your own social status. He's sending out further his education, that's spoil him, honestly. I don't know any of this stuff you're talking about. Hey mister, are you detect him now, you quit being a champion? Think you can detect my real one from a birthday? Sure, I'm a bro. Sure. Cool. You know, I don't want to give you something in return. There's an owl at the end of it. What has an owl? Owl. Oh, maybe look through the item shop? <laughs> Wait, does Gato have a count for that? Who? Like, the sweet thing? Fancy sweet that's like a Brick of something. I don't think you have it as an item, but maybe you can talk to the fish about it or something. Mm. Or maybe Pennington has an idea too. Well, that's nice. Go talk to Pennington. Maybe he has an idea. He's in six. Actually, yeah, let me see if I remember right. How uh, to spell it right. Yeah, Gato. Here, I'll type it in the Steam BC. Okay. That's the only thing I can think of that ends in that. BC? Okay. The only reason I know what it is is because of Pokemon. 
Nice. That's a Game Boy Advance, Luigi. I guess the modern youth culture's enthusiasm has never been stronger. Also, that is, uh, that is horribly outdated. Welcome. Well, I mean, this game's from 2004. I know. But it would be really funny if they updated that of all things. Well, no, I think that he, I think it adds even to it now that he's like, Yes, I know what the youth of today want. This 20-year-old console. It's, like, I think know, that adds to the charm now. That's actually pretty great. Like, I think that legit adds to the charm. It would, I feel like it would have been funnier if it was like, they want something, uh, or the kid has a line of like, oh yeah, I don't want that, that's so old now. I want someone's autograph. Wait, I thought you said it ended in... No, I said it started with. Oh. I heard ended in, but, uh... I don't know, I don't pay attention to things, so I might also... I'm hearing a 2v1 here, but we're probably gonna wanna go find that zip toad. Okay. So what did you two do today? Hmm? What did you guys do today? Eh, I just it I, I played hours upon hours of Warzone. So what I'm hearing is that you've done nothing new. Well, I also finally signed into the computer that work gave me. Good job. And then also I... What else did I do? Help my mom with the computer thing. This bubble tech merely wants something from so many admirers? What are you crazy? We best find it soon, old boy. Train is in danger. Well, so. Hmm. Yeah, I think Lady Toad might be convincing here. Oh, you find fine specimen, man. You, you're marvelous, dear. Such a rather tough on mystery, and yes, very well done. This is regularly smart. Perhaps you can help me out with something as well? How lovely. Look for a gold ring. Uh, sure. Actually, how far to the... Another door on the in the front. I wonder if that leads anywhere. It's the engineer car. That's not what I meant. But... Huzzah! 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 But yeah, you see how there is a door in the front right now? Yeah. I wonder what happens if you go into it. That's what it. Oh, this one. Yes. <laughs> It's to exit the train. Hmm. Still, where would that ring be? Assumedly it's in like the passion there, the main car, right? Yeah. Or maybe we can talk to the conductor? Maybe it'll be extremely obvious and shine on the floor or something.
Are you looking at him? No. Yes, you are. I think you are. Real talk, I still think that we should at least talk to the toad to see if we can gain access to the passion card. Who well, dreams of being a train engineer someday? I just didn't dream for a rich kid like that. <laughs> Wait. Okay, if he wants to do that, then let's go back to the engineer, I guess. Well, talk to the penguin. Maybe that'll trigger something first. And then you, yeah. can, and then you can get the train car engineers thing. Yeah. yeah. I highly doubt the penguin's gonna say anything intelligent. But... Nope. Nope, he still thinks he wants a Game Boy. Just a little more confused as to where the ending of this is. Same. I wonder where the end goal to all this is me on the train in the Star Rail. What's the angle we'll of Honkai Star Rail? No end. It's infinite, gotcha. Oh, well, that's how it goes for a game like that. Oh! An autograph. You got an autograph before it felt fantastic. Oh. You wanted the autograph for the train engineer. Okay. Well, that's nice. That's nice. I'm sure the guy's like, here you go, bud. Yeah. Yeah, train engineers. If there's one thing kids like kids so like, it's pilots and train conductors. And it's, it's just engineers. They like engineers. It's like, Bobby you get to drive the like big train. I like people who drive the big train. Here's the thing is that kids just really look up to adults in notable positions because they just hear about them. Yeah, but kids and especially love also, like airplane pilots and train conductors because like, you get to be on the plane! Play. It also isn't particularly helped by the fact that most kid-orientated toys are for those couple of jobs, which if you really think yeah. about it, doesn't really make a lot of sense. Like, why are there so many things for being a, like a policeman or oh. a pilot or whatnot? Propaganda. I guess. Yeah, I don't think they're gonna care for it at all. No. Hmm. Oh. Well, it's night now. Penguin man, now what? <laughs> the train conductor came by. Oh. Alright, so to the end of the train. <laughs> it's a blanky truck was handing him out to passengers. Blanket yes. <sighs> PI. Please don't call anybody that. That's extremely lame. I think it's supposed to be referenced like Magnum PI. I guess, but like at the same time, that is incredibly lame. <laughs> yes. It's like calling Superman spandex. <laughs> I'm down for that. Do you stay out of my way while I do paperwork? I don't believe you. Oh, 
I guess that rules out the the fat toad then. Yep. So it's seen the fish, the girl toad. Well, that fish there is the chef. That doesn't necessarily rule them out. There is an empty room in room four. Three had the fat toad, and then two and one are the uh, guest suite. They're like the super guest suites, but there's no necessarily ruling them out either. I guess that rules her out. She has quest dialogue. And she's trapped within it. Can you go to the bathroom real quick? Okay, well, cool. Have fun. Alright, Greg. You know what to do. <sighs> no, no, no. Not that one. The other one. See, okay, so... <laughs> what, so when, I, when we're asking for it, you can't call up animal effects on a dime? So, no, I, they've they've gotten into a log gym, and so the most cursed thing is that a locust is basically just a social grasshopper, and that's not cursed at all. You're right, that isn't very cursed. Well, what do you mean they got into a log gym? I have too many thoughts in my brain, and they got stuck, so they're not fitting out of my brain. Okay, so, like... What's your current thought? Uh... Adult ladybugs will eat newborn ladybugs. And... Um... Uh, are you gonna expand on that last one any more than no. that? No, I'm not. Did you know that sometimes female penguins will kidnap other penguins' chicks? Um, I thought I heard something about that, but, um, expand upon that for me. So, if a female penguin loses her chick, she will, in her devastation, acquire a new chick. However, she doesn't have a parental bond with this chick and will eventually just abandon it. So, what I'm ultimately hearing is that baby ch er, uh, adult penguins are just assholes. Yeah, they, they kidnap as a coping mechanism. And then don't even follow through with the kidnapping? They do not, they do not follow through. And you're welcome. I mean, it's not even. What is this? Like, it just seems stupid on so many levels from an evolutionary perspective. Certainly, yes, it's not, what's that? It's not great from the perspective of, you know, we need to protect, or like, that they are kidnapping baby eggs because they're sad, right? But, like, if they're just abandoning the chick anyway, what was the point of, uh, taking the egg? So that they could feel like they were doting on a chick for a while. Yes, but at that point, you might as well just find a rock in the middle of the frickin' tundra and sit on that one. Oh, uh, we're not- uh, this isn't- this isn't about taking care of an egg. This is about taking care of a live chick until you lose interest and walk away. Yeah, this seems like a poor evolutionary strategy. I'm not arguing with that. 
Well, then why does it happen? When I they... don't know. I'm not a penguin. But at the same time, like, wouldn't this phase itself out by virtue of the fact that penguins exposed to this die or something like that? Well, see, here's here's the problem. It's not that it's not the penguins that employ this strategy that die. It's it's the penguins that employ the strategy that get more practice nurturing a chick that's not theirs, and so when eventually they have a viable piece of offspring, they'll be in better practice or something, I don't know, and they will raise the chick that they actually care about goodly. Well. I don't freaking know. I'm just guessing here. Okay, moving on. Ducks sometimes practice necrophilia. I, we did not need to say that on this Twitch stream, thank you very much. Let's skip to the next one. The chemical compound that makes, like, synthetic banana flavor is the exact same chemical that honeybees use to signal an alarm. So, uh, if, so you, if you smell banana near a beehive, get out of there. So what I'm hearing is that if you threw a banana near a beehive, all the bees would get into a frenzy? Well, no, it's specifically artificial banana flavor. So, like, if you have a banana-flavored candy... Okay, but so if, then if you threw that at a, uh, at a beehive, they'd Then panic, panic, yes. Huh. Sloth is... mating strategy. Females will frequently, instead of expending energy to go find a mate, simply hang in the tree and scream until a male comes by in order to either mate with her or shut her up. It's hard to tell which. I mean... Isn't that just extremely liable to, uh... Attract predators? Yes. Why are animals... Well, I was going to ask why are animals so stupid, and then I remembered that we are also animals. Yes. Bear cat Maybe. poop smells like popcorn, and bear cats are capable of holding grudges, and how they work out these grudges is that they climb above those they dislike to poop popcorn smelling poop on them. What? <laughs> <laughs> I feel that this needs no further elaboration. Uh, I would like some more elaboration than what you've given. Thank you very much. Firstly, what's a bear cat? This is the first it's, time I've. It's the closest relative to the red panda. And, uh, if they don't like you, be prepared for popcorn flavor or smell. Not flavor. Not flavor. <laughs> I, was, I was thinking about oh, the bees. Oh, no. <laughs> I was thinking oh, about the bees still. Hold a minute. Greg, have you <laughs> eaten bear cat? <laughs> no. Are you sure about that? I returned. I'm not hearing a no! No. Hey. Hello, returned. Oh, I've seen something truly horrifying today. Okay. I saw Fillion actually say fuck instead of frick for the first time. Oh. Oh, goody. What do you mean? He said... Fuck, no. She hey, uses his frick. I was right. The empty cabin did have something. Okay, so since Matt missed out all of on all of the animal facts... Oh, God. <laughs> I, I have another one. So, you know how when a... Uh, 
when an angler fish meets, it's the male latches onto the female and just withers away. Okay. So didn't know that. Yeah. Okay, so the actual procedure is a bit worse than what you tend to hear about because we need a different person. So male male anglerfish basically come into the world hungry and horny. And both of these instincts combine when they encounter a female. So they find a, you know, they find the part that satisfies the horny side and bite on with a clear intent to consume. However, the female has a hormone that causes the male to instead fuse to her body. Great. And wither away, except for his testicles. Fantastic! I love what that. The... So you found me. Well, as you see, I'm a ghost. I'm cursed to haunt this place. A blanket? This could never leave when you didn't realize that I'm a ghost. I'm a sticky threat. Now I left no such thing. I can't even hold physical objects like pen and paper. You just want the blanket then? I'll tell you where it is if you do something for me. What do you say? Fine. All I need is. Your life! Okay, you can have it. I wasn't using it. But in exchange, I want you. Nah, again. just kidding. Actually, I passed away in this cab many years ago. I think my luck is still in the baggage car here. I have eggs diary kept since my urge, early childhood days. I fear someone would find it and just get me tied to this world. Can't believe this room. Can you please find and bring it in here? And please don't read it. You do, I'll show you where the blanket is. Why did you steal the blanket? <laughs> He didn't. They gave it to him, even though he's a ghost. Ah. Don't read the diary. If you do, so the horrible diary fate awaits you. The conductor didn't know he was a ghost and gave him a blanket just because that's what a good conductor do. Pum. <laughs> pum pum to Himiko eventually. I really do wonder if Welt has told her. Told who? Himiko, that in his universe she's dead. Probably. There's a ghost. Uh, hey. Go on in. You don't say no to ghosts. There's definitely some kind of maneuver attack that you can use to get around here. What? jump high enough for that. Yeah, it's a shame that you don't have like a ledge grab because I oh wait no hold on we're thinking too hard about this. Yeah. You got the diary. You shouldn't read it. You Reads it immediately.
Found the diary? Wonderful, I knew you would. I cannot be my post. Please turn the diary while I stay here. Oh boy. You want to get cursed, my friend. It's not like we haven't been cursed before. Yeah, it'd be nice to get a new power up. Exactly! Yes. Greg's got the right that mindset. Was from, that was from a face ghost, not a toad ghost. Well, that toad ghost needs to evolve into a boo already. Blanket is right here. Hooray, get a blanket. We've obtained a blanket. Everybody's not to read my diary, friend. Everybody you might be a spirit like me right now. Now I can go peacefully on from this world. Thank you so much. If I never meet me again in this world, fare thee well. Mario was saluting him <laughs> as the man goes to heaven. Or not. Actually, maybe not. I've been here so long, I've gotten kind of used to it. But paneling so great, maybe I'll stay here a little while longer. I only went over so that's all there is to it. Ho ho ho. Man literally was gonna get sucked up to heaven, was like, nah, I'm good. Nah, I wanna be on this posh train that has nothing on it. That I can't touch. Yeah, sure, buddy. Ghosts don't exist. Now let me introduce you to a ghost and another ghost. Dude, we're playing Pokemon. Welcome to Ghost Types. Second past numbers of ghosts, Luigi, you are delusional. Well, I guess that resolves the case then. Can we sleep now? Ghost in the train? Does it have a ticket? I do. I bought one fair and square. On my expense account. Are we sure this man's expense account actually works? No. They're still arguing? <laughs> yeah. I say talk to the conductor. I need you with the blanket. Here you go. I'll be comfortable tonight. Take this. Food. Rip mystery, we'll never know what was in you. Okay, I will not worry about anything at all. Ever again. Oh yeah, um, did I tell you guys what they announced yesterday at uh, Comic-Con? No, you did not. So they announced who Doctor Doom is going to be, who the actor is. Oh, oh no. yeah, you, you announced yeah. That. Apparently, yeah. the internet is going. I don't know, but the no a bunch of them are also going. The quote from Thanos: "You cannot live with your own failure." Where did that bring you? Back to me. <laughs> it's so fucking funny. Cause it's so Honestly, goddamn bro, true. I feel like I feel like they've really got that. Or, do you remember that YouTube video I posted a while back with the whole game, like, having celebrities as actors rather than actual actors as actors? Yeah, I feel well, like he's an actual like, actor. He won a literal well, Oscar, yeah. Daniel. I know, I know, but I feel like that was more him putting himself onto Iron Man and it working rather than being Iron Man. 
Which is a stark difference. In ha, my ha, ha, ha. I mean, a stark difference in my mind as to no, how I, active. No, but stark. Oh. Screw you both. Flattered, but you're not my type. Luigi, your time is impeccable. New cases has arisen. Uh, Mr. Business Man, please explain the facts to my assistant, Luigi. Here's the deal. When I woke up this morning, my briefcase was gone. I can do all our contracts for next day and even our new product prototype. If I don't cover, lose my job at the least. Calm yourself. The next part is vital. Tell Luigi very slowly. Our company's new product uh, is Nitro uh, Honey course. Syrup. Uh, He's probably an amazing course. product. I can even raise the dead. Uh, next. Mix, mix the calcium... From a she shell and a bit of gold. The results are explosive. There's one good lesson was everyone here in a sticky and yummy shellac. It's one of the wrong hands, I could lose more than my side job. Why is this even something that we are talking about? Like Mario Uh, yeah. Bennington, you've done it again. Can I get a goo blast? Surely that won't be a problem. We must find it. Before it's put into effect and we all die. Okay. Roll out! <laughs> I believe myself to be the cult. Said, who else can we really even? Actually, hold on. What about the ghost? The ghost probably wasn't sleeping. I go talk to the ghost. It's no other nights today. This is gonna make me feel I'm floating on air. Well, but I guess the ghost is pretty useless. Anybody else got anything useful to say? He's going to be any kind of. I'm gonna go talk to the chef. Mm, probably. I still think that it's the the celebrity toad. But... No, it was me, Dio. Hmm. 
What are you doing? Just jump around. The chef is over there! I already talked to him, I got nothing. Then go talk to the to the fancy pants uh, toad at the front, like I said. Okay. Let's see if that one helps. Go talk to Pants Toad. Or if that one doesn't work, go talk to the Babong. Maybe they have something all exploding everywhere. That's racist. Ah. <laughs> Oh. Hey, I was right. A vital paper. Look at me, I'm the genius now. So I suggest we bring that to the hang time. Yep. That said, the very fancy pants celebrity is the one who's actually the crook. Yep. Or is it a bait? No! Is it a bait of a bait? What do you think? Contracts for my upcoming business deal. I found this clue. Zip Toad's room. I don't believe we've seen her today. Or she's hiding somewhere. Well, let's go figure it out. My big guess is by either the back or the front. We can't go to the back, so let's try to find it. And check every room along the way. We actually... Check the front of the train, like the very front of the train. Yeah. And, then I'm gonna, and then I'm gonna go room by room again. And fuck it, I'm gonna use Vivian. Well, I'm still of the opinion that that one floor might be. Well, I guess it wouldn't really mean anything if you're on the train. Yeah. Well, it is a problem on the train. Hmm. Or maybe he's not going to show up until it's dusk, so we need to sleep? But how do we make time go faster otherwise? Yeah, I don't think he's gonna enter the room. There's either a way into some place here, or somewhere else. But I don't. Or I would think that since everybody keeps saying something about dust, that might be the best time to go for. It, I'm not sure. Well, maybe I'll go for a nap then. I mean, if either of you two have anything to add to this thinking process, feel no. free to speak up. Also, thanks, Greg. Oh, oh. you're welcome. Paper. What? 
Oh. Gun. He had a very predictable pattern of jumping. Gee. The Zermin all on pretty to be zip toed, I see. Pilfering things to add to your plan. No longer you were a fake. You just discolored nostril hair tipped me off. I knew you were the one that threatened Luigi. I was gonna wave up again for Riverside Station 2. I don't see I've this improbably large brain. Return to you, stolen. Briefcase. Gold ring. Earrings. Well, I guess those are lost. Here's a briefcase, sir. Imagine if you didn't give it back after you got it back. In the yeah. Road. You didn't do anything. Look, at this point, I'm of the opinion that this penguin will just say whatever the fuck he wants to make himself look better. The less we have to uh, interact with this penguin, the better, right? Mm. I know they it's probably like that. kidnaps other penguins' children. <laughs> Why are you still on with that? Why wouldn't I be? You think I have an off switch? Belgium would flip if I let that happen. Oh shit. It's dupless. Well, there you go, I guess. Goodbye. Let him get outside. Surely nothing bad will happen when we go outside, like you're getting your names from you again. Yeah, I'm not too sure how I feel about that whole penguin. Yeah. Thing. The penguin thing one. You passed Speaking it. of the penguin, there's a TV show. Is it any good? They announced it today. They released a trailer finally. Is it any good? I don't... They, they've said nothing so far. I haven't watched the trailer yet. Also, beer would be my ice cream this year. Mm. Well, Greg, you know what time it is. Uh, can't talk. Trying not to crash a way too fast battleship in waves of steel. What do you have on this battleship that's making it go way too fast? Here? So I took off everything, like all of the uh, weapons and armor and stuff, so like I could just go as fast as I could with the fastest engines and stuff. And I have three of the overdrives. Nice. And a drill on the front. Nice. This is not useful in the slightest. It's mostly just maneuvering practice. Mm, I see. And I'm failing at practicing. Oh uh, yeah, did you try that thing that we were talking about the other day, the flipping disco battleship? Yes. It is not uh, terribly useful, but it is glorious. Well, I mean, that's all we're looking for, right? Just flip around, things explode. Can you actually like a flip a side? It's a graceful cassowary in flight. <laughs> <laughs> Why is that the analogy you want for? Because cassowaries are flightless birds, and I can only imagine the expression they would make <laughs> if they went airborne. I see. Have you seen the faces on those things? Yes. Sends up to the drawbridge, the train can't leave the station like this. Well, did you try bashing the drawbridge down? Just drawbridge with... Bash the drawbridge with the train, that's a good idea. It's not like someone apparently derailed a train this week to get clout on social media. 
I'm it's sorry. a real thing. I saw it with Charlie. Was critical pointed that out. In what way does that get you clout? I don't know, but because they're like, look, well, because they weren't gonna tell everyone that they caused the accident, but then the cops were like, this is weird. Why is this kid sitting here and why is this camera here? So they went and looked at the security footage, like, ah, oh, you flipped a switch that was locked. You broke a padlock and flipped a switch, and you derailed the train. You caused three hundred fifty thousand dollars of damage. Uh, Wait, you're going to jail, and we're that? gonna charge you as an adult. Anybody die from it? No. Well, thank God for that. That's I know. Nice. But yeah, seriously, how is this kid expecting to get clout and not get arrested? He was thinking they didn't wouldn't look at the security footage and see him. This kid's an idiot. No shit! I understand, and I get it, but also... But also, I don't understand! This is like the bare minimum of understanding of how security works, that there's probably going to be people looking at the security there. How... Well, the cops were first suspicious because, like, why is there a camera pointed exactly where the train Well, moved? no, not, not, the ki not the cops, the kid. Oh. I don't know, he's like, a dumb 17-year-old who wanted social media clout. I don't know, Daniel. I don't know the mind of a 17-year-old. That's 17 -year -old. awful dumb. Yeah, I know. Like, even for a 17-year-old, it's like... You should think a little bit harder than that. You should think at all. Exactly. Yeah, there's a fruit on in there. There's stairs here. You would think that your stairs should actually be functional and not hidden behind a switch, but what do I know? Quite a lot, apparently. There is a cloud. Yes. I jumped on him. I feel like this shouldn't have worked for me. Apparently I stand corrected. Only combat. It only took us an hour. I know. Uh, that was probably getting electric. That's electric. Uh, I thought they were going after Bob Ray again. Damn it. I have immunity from electricity still. Yeah. No. <laughs> then why did you say that? I thought I still had that badge on. Well, the badge disagrees, and it made its disagreement very. That's my bad. Your there we go. Oh, you know what we forgot to do? I forgot to ask you to let me play Super Mario so we could see how the uh, how the guarding works and see if it's as problematic as you're making it out to be. Which one? Which Super Mario? This Mario. Oh, oh Paper yeah. Paper Mario. Popper Mario. Well, there are hearts. You have obtained Kingdom Hearts. Oh, wow, that one in the back has the lightning. Yeah. Should we drop a lightning on it? Or maybe we should use some of that star power. Actually, have we even seen Art Attack yet? Uh, no. Uh, yeah, we have. Art Attack is in the back. Keep drawing. They can only use it once. Oh, yes, yeah, so with Star Paradise, you can use it a lot more, but I forgot that you can use it more than once. 
Well, it seems to be one of those time-based things, so you're supposed to draw as Can't many carry times more items. Well, I might as well use some of those super shrooms. And now, time for some good old ability to fly. You know how to platform, right? What's platform? Not that. You know, can you even make it across the whole way with Yoshi? Because I feel... Oh, you can't even jump that high with Yoshi. I wait for the next cycle. What? I didn't even stop. Well, because all of them desync repeatedly, so you technically are off cycle now. Ironically enough, Fuck. Well, I think either that or their very first chance that you tried for your best chances for that. I'll leave the room and reset it. Probably a good idea. God damn it. Don't worry, Matt. I believe in your ability to platform. Keep jumping that, too early. Honestly, that one you were good. You just need to come in. Yeah. Ah. That pink one was held there for a long time. God damn it. I mean, the pink one seems to be holding the longest, with the yellow one holding second longest because of the shortest cycle, and then green being the longest in terms of rotation, and then the what? blue being relatively short in all regards. I shouldn't have even tried to go for that. Uh, yeah. Well, so what you could probably do is you could be Yoshi once you're on the planet. But you cannot do it until you're on. And I don't know how much time you got for that to set that up. Ah, no, the platform drags you down. Yeah. That's unfortunate. So you just gotta commit to the jumps. I missed that. Ow. Through bad luck. is not going to help. Though it also seems like you're trying to short hop it and short hopping it is not actively making it onto the platform. 
platform whether or not the platform is staying or not. Hmm. Yeah, it's that last one that's the problem child here, huh? Yeah. can hover in the middle for a little bit between purple and blue. Probably. Well, I mean, that's about the only thing I can think of that can make this easier, because the rest of it is pretty simple to get to, aside from the blue part. Because blue seems to be the most decent out of all. Is not far enough, and you keep hopping off. Is that what's happening? I think so. Like you landed. It's the next one. Okay, the idea works. You just need to hold your position, and maybe you can handle that. Next one. Move to front of the right. Yeah. Mm. Should be the one after they stop again. Way to turn these off or something. There might be. Well, there weren't any other rooms we could access, right? Oh, that would have been it. Fuck. Yeah, you just need to hold it as long as possible, I think. No, the pink didn't move. Well, no, that's what I mean is that you need to hold it in the middle for longer. But she went too fast to the right and got squatted down. Yeah, the blue is just highly inconsistent compared to the rest of them because one through three have a pattern. Four is the one that I can't determine the pattern for right now. Yeah, let's just watch it. Here, you, you watch it for a second. Let's watch it.
Hmm. Well, I was going to say the next time yeah. the other three sync up, you're good, but now I don't know what the cycle is because you just missed the cycle that I think worked. I'm doing it again. Mm. Well, I mean, this is going to take another bit. That's fine. This one, or the next one, the yellow ghost. It's gonna be a trick to this. I mean, there is, but it's patience. Oh well, I guess Matt's host. Oh so well. Like, let's see here. If you're looking at the internet, I'm pretty sure the internet is going to say the exact same thing I am. Somewhere in between those la like, last couple of seconds where you were on the second to last platform, I think the one hit. Me yeah. too. Um, where did it need to hit, theoretically? I'm not really sure what kind of pattern recognition you're following, but the blue needs to be in motion when the other three start lining up. So, like, the yellow is gonna start now, but the blue is still there, so it's not gonna land. Oh, wait, hold on, you can do that. Apparently. Yeah, I guess you could hop stuff in there and consider that as an option. On the road again. Can you heal Bobbery? No. Well, maybe. Let me check. Yeah, I guess I can. You could either do that or recover some flower power. I think I'll recover some flower power. Mm. Where's the key? Well, how do we get to the key is the question. Well, at well, least we needed to get there. It's not just an item. Indeed. That was annoying. <laughs> yeah, it could have been worse. Maybe. I'm not sure about that. 
Thanks, Greg. Well, they couldn't have had an easy solution or an easy out to the problem. I'm trying to see if there's any other secrets here. One sec. Some pokies. Well, yeah, but they're poisonous pokies, apparently. Mm. You've leveled up. What do you think this time? I say you need to live. Okay. <laughs> okay, then what was your choice? Death. What do you Thanks, mean, Greg. death? He means death. dead. What was that one? Alright. Oops, wrong one. Attained vampirism. Congratulations. Oh, no, now wait. you sparkle. I was going to say that maybe we should replace that with one of the mushrooms. Okay. It's taking five from an enemy can be very helpful. Take five. Ooh. Oh. 
Okay. They attempted to poison me, but I got lucky. Alright, well that was successful. Yay. Easy peasy. Yep, yep, yep. Oh my god, I'm getting so many items. Maybe this is a sign that we need to use more items. Yeah. Speaking of... I'm gonna use a lightning here. I call upon the power of Zeus! Pretty much. See, when I hear a Zeus... Oh, uh, it gained my brain, HP. My brain feels in zero. Well, I mean, I guess that makes sense, given that it's a good one. But... Call upon the power of Zeus. It's a slightly different game. That means we gotta whack him with a hammer or something. Well, I guess we can jump on the cloud. Okay. I don't know. That one you need a slightly more. Forward. Yeah, need more forward momentum. Oh, no, never mind. I guess that'll work. Oh, it'll work in now. I got him. Hooray. Yeah, succeeded something. Hmm. Suggest using the frost one since your heels are And now we're frozen. Okay. I mean, one of them is going to hit, and one of them should hit, but... Or they can die. Holy shit, 16 star points. Jesus. That's from a non-boss enemy fight. I mean, hey, there were four enemies. Joke's on you, that... that was actually a boss fight. <laughs> Imagine if the boss fight this time was pretty easy. Hey, maple syrup. Hey, we're getting more inventory. Oh, there's a badge up there. Well, how do you propose we get that one? Fly. Can we blow away those papers on the wall? The ones on the bottom, not up here. Hey, what do you know? Nothing. Thank you. Apparently. Oh boy. Yeah, I don't know if that one's gonna work there, Chief. What? I don't think that that shell troopa gets close enough for that. I don't know how either of you hit each other. Neither of us did. Well, one of you had to because one of you started this fight. No, I started this fight. What do you mean you started the fight? I decreed it to be so. <sighs> okay, I agree. I agree. You 
little too much to not drink tonight. I've had a little too little to eat. Yeah, compared to oh. yesterday, Jesus. I mean, to be fair, he still didn't eat so much. Yeah, I, know. I mean, by great standards, he wouldn't eat. Actually, I can't. I think I've had less than 3,000 calories today. How much is the normal calorie intake of a human? 2,000. People tell me it's 2,000, but if I do 2,000 calories a day, I start fainting. What the? Huh? <laughs> What am I supposed to do here? Uh, I'm gonna use the item. Yeah, that might do it. Well, you know, I'm gonna make some toast. Okay. Thunder? Yeah, I think I'm going to. There we go. I knocked him out. Yeah. I feel like this is the stupid DK minigame from 7. The one that was like, Oh, yeah. Uh, choose your route. Not that way. That way gives you less money. Speaking of routes, though, this place goes pretty frickin' far down. Well, ain't that helpful. Um, now what? You cannot, uh, reach there. Fuck. Uh. <laughs> uh... Spring. So we need to stay on the left side, I guess. Yep. Uh, that else one leads to a dead end, didn't it? No. Yeah. down here. Or, yeah, down there, sorry. And down there. I don't think you can go that way, can you? I'm hitting one button. That. Door. Let's get rid of that dry mushroom, eh? Or you could use that. Nope. It's close for comfort there, huh? I know. There's a lock. And there's a Goomba. And there are blocks. Where are these blocks? Uh, what is this, a math quiz show? You know what? I bet, I bet it is. 
It is. Well, press the button on the wall and let's see what happens. Turn red. Hey. Okay. Touch. Oh, stairs again. Well, congratulations, you figured it out. <laughs> Very odd. Boots. You can jump slightly higher now. You have freed me from my prison again. Where are you the oh, ultra I didn't know you were our faceless stealth. You can use a new way. jump technique too. What don't name rotate L. Spring jump. Ah, there we go. What the frig? can just jump over everything or we or do we not have any kind of uh, horizontal There's no more uh, horizontal moment. Well that's where Yoshi comes in. To the great beyond. Ah, I see. Now, what happens if we use a super jump here? I said I can knock things off. I mean, you can still jump that, I'm pretty sure. Now back up to the top. I think so. Avoid any of the battles that you skipped. The answer is yes. Congratulations. You got it. Hmm. This is a lot longer than I was gonna give it. Yeah, I don't know that one's gonna work. I think you're gonna have to backtrack all the way back. Yeah. But yeah, how much more do we want to do? 
I think we're gonna get to the next time I can save. Wait, hold on, man. You can't. Wait, 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 wait. Go back. Go back. Save. And not that great. I'm on the train. Hold yourself. HP plus. There you go. Do you even have badge space? No, I need more badge power. You need more. 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 <laughs> okay, Kylo Ren. More. This one's your ass. Yes, but at least there are occasionally an entertaining. True. Uh, well, you've never seen them. No, but I've seen some of the memes. Which that is better is not... than some modern movies get, where they're not even, like, meme-worthy entertaining. The Force Awakens was good in that it got rid of my headache. Yeah, I like The Force I Awakens, would. but the other two are ass. I went into the theater with a headache, and I left the theater without a headache. Ew, really? What is that? A headache. Uh... Man, this is dust. Well, this is originium this? dust. Working enough. Scatter! Scatter! Never mind, we're clipping through shit. Scatter! A button. Oh, gee. Push. You would think that their railway system would be easier to access. But then 17 year olds could get to it. <laughs> Oh man, no, yeah, that's true. Enough. How to stop a 17 from fucking with your train? This. Look at this cockamamie shit. Oh, we're going up, apparently. Well, I mean, assuming we. We were going down for that. Somehow. Yeah. Well, it is also pointing downwards, so there's that. We can actually with, with, with the super jump, we can get that badge on the side. I think so, yeah, let me go back in. Post call P, when your partner... Uh, it's the same thing for Mario. It, it's a lucky badge, if they're below 5 HP, though, enemies may miss. Hey. Alright, let's get back on the train. Hurry on board. Surely it's not been that long since we got here. It's been three months since you went into there, man. Yo, G mates, me, King K, your buds from the Glitz Pit. I know you remember me, how you doing? What, you have K and fools left and right somewhere else? I'm still living large in the minor league, but I'm keeping busy. You know how it is. Gotta thank you for convincing me to stay. You fired me up good. Are we gonna chill again or what? Or are we just gonna meet in the green? Careful, next time you front on the King K, I'm gonna be way, 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 way better. Keep real, King K. Hello, King K. You can't make me keep it real. I will make it fake. Oh, now he says all on. Let's -a go! Forward! And we accidentally run over the. I know, he's standing like really close to the train tracks. And, and like lower too. It's I'm not sure even like, safe. oh, he, like he's below the wheel. Bing bong, bing Thank bong! Thank you for your patience. Our next stop is our last, Poshley Heights. Oh, but sign is sleeping. Hopefully no world-ending disasters happen while Mario shuts his eyes. 
Wow, shuts Nothing his eyes. He just all. wakes up to just like pa wanton panic. He wakes. He wakes up in freaking uh, cyberpunk. Yeah. Wake up, samurai! We got a city to burn. Yeah. All right. Let me see what's next online. Let me just check if there's more to this. Uh, yeah. It looks like there is. Okay. I think we should stop here then. There's still a bit yeah. more. But let me return the stuff to the, uh, to, like, everybody that got their shit stolen. So that's the waitress and the person in room two. Then. Yes. It's a good room, too. Everybody isn't. Maybe we need to leave the train? Okay. Everybody put your hands where I can see them! You know, I think we'll stop here, actually. But I th there is a boss fight coming up, I think. Because obviously there's a boss fight at some point. Well, I mean, clearly the boss fight is the uh, amalgamated corpses of all the other train riders all fused together. Oh good, they're like the Rat King from Last of Us. Yeah, no, they're like the Rat King from Arknights. Wait. Oi. So the Rat King is a thing that we did not see in se It was not in Season 1. It's fucking horrifying, and it just one-shots you. <laughs> well, gee. Like, in the game it goes, oh, and it sees you, and it hits you once, and you're just fucking dead immediately. In the video I game. I have to imagine that it's not even like a hard tab, it's just like it kind of flails its finger at you, but you just instant die. It anyway. just, no, it just does like, it like flicks its finger, like how in like a cartoon. It just walks up to you, goes, Ugh, and like just lazily slaps its hand and you just die. Yeah. Like it's like when you wake up in the morning, you're like, Ooh, what time is it? Like you move your hand to like wake up. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, chat. I think we're going to pause it here for the night. Um, that was pretty good. Uh, it was kind of long, though. Like, I don't know. This is not my favorite part of the game. From what I remember seeing. That's okay. Um, this week, we have a Honkai news schedule starting this week. So, we are now only streaming Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Saturday and Sunday. We are no longer streaming on Fridays for the time being. Uh, just because it's a bit of a lull moment right now in gaming... Um, and there's not really like a big stuff thing. To catch up on. Yeah, we've got to catch up on a bunch of stuff. Um, yeah, we're we're not gonna be streaming on Fridays for now. Um, that'll that'll resume as we probably get towards the end of the year and more stuff comes out. Though we are in a bit of a holding pattern because Nintendo is kind of they're saving yeah, all their okay. stuff for next year. Like this is their biggest game of the year so far, and then I think like I don't even know what else is coming out later this year. It's like some other stuff. Like Luigi's Mansion is getting ported. When is Luigi's Mansion 2 coming to Switch, anyway? When is that supposed to come? That's coming out in, um... When is that coming out? Oh, it's out. It's it's just out. It came oh, out a month ago. <laughs> oh, well, thanks. I guess it exists. But yeah, no, so Dark Moon, yeah. But, like, I don't know. There's really... We're going to catch up on things and just chill out for a bit. So, the new schedule is, for the week, we're now going to stream... Honkai Star Rail on Tuesday. Cobblemon is going to continue on Wednesdays in Minecraft. And then um, 
on Thursdays, we're going to continue Pokemon Sun. Uh, Saturday is going to be Nier Automata once again. We just wanted to finish Warship Gunner last week. So that's it. And then we're going to keep doing this Paper Mario on Sunday. So that's the new schedule for the next time being. Maybe we'll sprinkle in some extra stuff soon. Uh, maybe a Black Ops 2 playthrough since we're getting closer and closer and closer to Black Ops 6. And that ties into Black Ops 2. So maybe we'll we got get to some that. things in mind. We'll see how long it takes or how long Matt can remember they exist. Yeah. But yeah, what do you what do you two think of today? Like I think today's kind of dull. Like this this chapter is not my favorite. Yeah, it's, the we could have There's not too much com- there needs to be more combat. Yeah, it's pretty solidly okay. Yeah, this is the weakest chapter of the game like, so far. Like in, like it's neat, but it's kind of boring. In, like in general, it's it's good, but it's not up to the same level of uh, of interesting as the rest of the game so far. Yeah, I don't know. I feel this game is weighed down by this, but uh, yeah, that will do it. So we shall see you all on Tuesday because new Star Wars update this week. Yay! We're going back to the La Fu. Wait, Boo! Oh man, is it? Will it be releasing on Tuesday or will it be on Wednesday? Uh, I mean, what's the, it's usually on Tuesday, isn't it? I think so, but we let me look totally up. verify. <laughs> if it's not on Tuesday, then we're doing Call of on Tuesday and. Star on Wednesday. Yeah, if, yeah, we'll swap it out. But yeah, here the release time. Here I'm seeing. No, it's Tuesday. It's it's Tuesday. It's Tuesday. Hey. Yeah, so we'll, we'll do that. We, we've got the new March skin and path, and we have Yunli stuff and Joe oh, Chi right. stuff. I need to do, do roles for Yunli. Okay, yeah, we will stream that then. Daniel will stream oh, for Yunli. I don't know if we're gonna stream that. I don't have mm. that many this time. <laughs> 